I'm Eugen Lin, and I decided to do my cell project on the animal cell. I will be telling you each organelle, cell parts, and its function. I'll be starting with the nucleus. The nucleus is this pink cotton ball part, and it acts like the brain of the cell. Like our brain controls our body, the nucleus controls the cell. Now I'm going to go chromosomes. This is the black thing thread-like substance that's inside the nucleus. It's a thread-like structure of nuclear acids, and there's protein found in most living cells. It, um, it carries its genetic material, DNA. Now I'm gonna go on to endoplasmic reticulum, which is this brown um, string-like um, string -like structure found around the nucleus. They transport lipid and in regions where ribosomes are attached of proteins. There are rough ones and smooth ones, so they feel different. Now I'm going to go to the cytoplasm. The cytoplasm is pretty much the whole like cell. It's um, a jelly-like substance with organelles, cell parts in found inside. Now I'm gonna go to the mitochondrion, which are these thingies, or as I see on here. They act like digestive systems which take in nutrients, break them down, and create energy-rich molecules for the cell. And this process is called cellular respiration. Now I'm gonna move on to the Golgi body, which is the yellow string you see on here. The function of this is to Modify, process, and sort newly produced proteins inside the cell. Now I'm going to go to the cell membrane. The cell membrane is like the outer ridge of it. And the function of this, it's a flexible structure, and it controls what goes into the cell and what goes out of the cell. Now I'm going to go to the ribosomes, which are the red dots. Some of them are pink a little bit, so... And they are the um, protein builders or the protein synthesizers of a cell. All cells have ribosomes to manufacture their proteins. And now I will show you my project.